Welcome back, everybody. This is Cliff, and I have some Cliff tips on our recent trip to Baja, California, Sur. We wanted to go snorkeling. We had heard that Cabo Pulmo had the best snorkeling and free diving in the area. I put together this video to give you some tips and tricks to make sure that you get there using the most effective route. There's a fast way and there's a scenic way, but the scenic way is not the fast way. This video will help get you there. Now, Cabo Pumo does offer world-class scuba diving, snorkeling, and free diving. They have guided tours, and there's also unguided snorkeling available. You can snorkel from the beach at El Arbolito, but there are some differences between the beach at Arbolito and Cabo Pumo that you need to know. If you find the information in this video useful, please like and subscribe. <laughs> And if you've been to Cabo Pulmo or Arbolito yourself, we'd love to hear your comments below. We flew into San Jose del Cabo. I didn't realize it at the time, but our flight path took us directly over Cabo Pulmo National Marine Park, as well as the beach that would become our favorite snorkeling location, Playa El Arbolitos. Flying over, you can see these two locations are very close to one another, but there are important differences that I'll explain later. We left Cabo San Lucas and headed out to Cabo Pumo choosing the coastal route. What we didn't know was it was mostly dirt road and very slow. So this is the route I should have taken. Although the coastal route was scenic, it just took way too long. The northern route through Santiago had a comfortable drive on good paved roads. These were not the paved roads we enjoyed on the way back. Arriving in Cabo Pumo, we took a short break and looked around the small village of about 100 residents. Although originally a fishing village, Cabo Puma has become a world-class destination for snorkeling, scuba diving, and free diving, and the village focuses on providing services to visitors seeking that world-class experience. Checking at the local dive shop, we were directed to Playa Arbolitos for beach snorkeling. So Dale. Yes, sir. Uh -huh, yeah. How, how, you, ahead, lo how you loving the uh, the dirt road experience out here? Uh, the Baja, Baja 1000. You see the smile on my face? I'm not loving it. Yeah. But. <laughs> look at that, look at that, look at that. Oh, oh my It's the part of Mexico. See that? Look at that. Yeah. Oh. Like snakes. Only different. We're going to go up here to, where are we going? Arbolito? Yeah. See? Normal. Inside? Right there, to the left. Tell me what the Thursday special. Hola! We're hoping to get the uh, Thursday special today. <laughs> See, nah? Charge? 50 pesos. 50 pesos per person! Okay. There's only five of it. 250 pesos. Toilets. Outstanding. Toilets? Yeah. B collect your belongings before you leave and leave before 5 30. No problem there. Okay, 250. Yen. Okay, that's good. See you later. The nice thing about the video is that I can catch capture still images off of any of it. So if there's, if, you know, you might look like crap for an hour, but if there's one brief moment where you, good? you look cool, you can get that. Nah, I wouldn't. But yeah, I could. <laughs> <laughs> well, hey, Tiffy, could, could we use your condo next time without taking you? <laughs> I was thinking about coming down here next time with my friends. <laughs> After a short drive from Cabo Pulmo, we arrived at Playa Arbolitos. This rustic location features overnight access for campers, restrooms, limited equipment rentals, as well as drinks and snacks. But stay tuned and I'll share the most important difference between Cabo Pulmo and Playa Los Arbolitos.
Welcome to Playa Arbolitos. It took us probably about three times longer than anticipated because of Dale Leishman. We finally made it to the beach and into the water and had an amazing snorkeling experience with a huge variety of fish and comfortable water temperatures. The biggest difference between these two amazing locations is that snorkeling from the beach is not permitted in Cabo Pumo because of the high volume of tour boats that come and go from the beach the safe location to plan your beach snorkeling experience is Playa Arbolitos. Of course, if an organized tour is to a remote offshore location is your preferred snorkeling experience, then Cabo Pumo is the place for you. Just make certain that no matter how you choose to snorkel, always take the northern route. You'll be glad you did. And we'll see you on the beaches.